in the whole of Europe, all the different cultures and languages and seemingly barriers, the common thing is the love of the horse. And when it comes to, you know, natural approach, using love language and leadership, um, it just seems like it just brings people together. It just resonates with them in their hearts. That's Pirelli! Thank you, everybody. What I want to share with you tonight is a way that horses feel about the world. I made some big decisions in my life, and the, my number one decision was to become a horseman instead of a horse trainer. One of the interesting things about going to, to Germany is the translation quotient. I speak, and then they have to say it and translate it. And sometimes I can say something as simple as, you know, uh, this horse really uh, want safety, comfort, and play. And then, you know, and then I'll leave it like that, and then they'll, they'll say, the fair, I'm going, did I say all that? So, let's start to think about horses. Who loves to watch horses in the pasture? Thank you, man, for caring. Now, where are you? This care is to be all about the next divide. Who loves to watch them play? This is the thing you should always do every chance you get, is to watch horses in nature. What I want you to know about horses, number one, they are prey animals. Number two, they live in herds. They are herd, they are herd animals.